hope you guys are having an awesome day because welcome back to another video. My name is Michael and today, since today is the day before St. Patrick's Day, we're going to do a little video of unlucky people. How lucky are you guys? I mean, I am pretty lucky. I'm lucky with entertaining all of you guys and I think that's awesome. Whee! And also, I'm pretty lucky to have an amazing brother that you guys seem to absolutely love in my videos. So, I'm going to build up some power right now. Alright, built up a lot of power. And I'm ready to go, Max. Hey, what up, Max? <laughs> <laughs> Getting the get more in the camera. Oh, good. <laughs> Max. Okay, Max. I can't make a video if you're just eating yogurt. Oh, by the way, Max, you can't pinch me because I'm wearing green. I'm wearing some green on this shirt, and you know what that means? You're not wearing green. Mm -hmm. You're just putting. You're just putting some green in your mouth. That does this not. This is count. green. This is green, though. Nope. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. No, I get to pinch you, dude. Pinchy, pinchy. Okay, fine. I'm not gonna pinch you. Why am I? <laughs> Ooh, I have a hat. What do you guys think of my hat? I'm. Um, I'm styling right now. I'm the paper hat boy. Hey. <laughs> Why? I'm gonna eat your yogurt. <laughs> Are you actually kidding me? Get your butt out of the camera. Now there's paper literally everywhere. You're picking it up. Oh yeah, sure. Let's go. <laughs> yep, Max, I'm really sure people really do. Yeah. I'm pretty sure people really do want to see you eat your yogurt. Alright. Oh, seriously? Are you actually kidding me, Lucky Charms? How are you gonna call those Lucky Charms if there's not even any marshmallows? You actually had one job, and that was to put marshmallows in the Lucky Charms. That's not Lucky Charms. Alright. Lucky Charms is the... Is delicious marshmallows in the cereal. This is not now whip it like a sauce, boy. Next. Okay. Next. 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 Shell ahead. Are you sure it's a shell or a hippopotamus? What is that hippo? Ah! Next, next, next! I'm not next. watching this button. Oh. This is just <laughs> by a will that me. We don't accept that kind of language here. Ow, we. <laughs> Means poop in a different language. But guys, seriously. Hippopotamuses are actually really scary in real life. Let's move on to the next picture, otherwise Max is gonna go crazy! <laughs> okay, bye! <laughs> oh my god. I thought that was a nice blade for a second. Well, it's not a knife blade, it's a, uh... A handle. Well, guys, apparently we're gonna do the rest of the video without Max. So, um, uh, hope you enjoyed that. I don't know how cold it gets where you live, but you should probably, um, get a new car. I mean, I think this one's a little out of the weather. That was absolutely stupid. I'm just gonna... Oh my gosh! Max, come here and look at this. All right, Max, look at this picture. Audio. That's me. Look, that girl's about to get whapped by the seagull. I think that's a seagull. That dog. 
No, that's that's a dove. Oh my gosh! Oh no! Oh ah! No! What even happened here? The car just sank into the ground somehow. Like maybe that's water or just like super wet cement. I, I have absolutely no idea, and I'm an absolute idiot. But you guys can comment that down below. And in the comment section, I don't care because I could just delete your comments anyway. So, uh. I'm sorry, now you're gonna have to get a new car. It could have been worse. I mean, it could have been like a sinkhole that just opened unexpectedly and then you would have took a big fat L. <laughs> I just wanna ask what happened here? Like, what? How? How does this. <laughs> what? It's funny. Okay, actually, it's, it's not, because now you're stuck, and yeah. But it is funny in a way, but terrible at the same time. Cold weather can lead to funny yet terrible times. Like, one time when me and my uncle, um, Zach, aka Fortnite Fanatic, a hey, subscribe to him, link in the description below, or actually, no, send the iCard. We were riding back home, and we saw this truck who just couldn't get his tires to grip onto the road. And his tires just kept on slipping on the ground, and it honestly was pretty funny. <laughs> but that is terrible at the same time, because he can't move. You're probably going to have to wait until the snow breaks down or, like, melts or something. Honestly, I feel really bad for you. Ah! Ooh, This actually makes me cringe. I'm just trying to imagine the pain it will take to get that off. Enjoy getting that out, because that is going to be one heck of a hard time. How does this actually even happen? How do you accidentally get your heel stuck in a shower drain? Like, what? How does that actually even happen? Okay, it probably wasn't a shower drain. It's probably like one of those like community showers. Which are disgusting, by the way. I have absolutely no idea what even happened, but I'm just gonna move on because I'm going to get my brain is just gonna stop working. <gasps> you know, if that cement is wet. Then maybe put a wet cement sign, you flipping construction workers. You had one job. You actually had one job. If you don't put a sign that says wet cement right there, the bikers are going to think that it's safe to go across that cement, but they're just going to sink their bikes into the cement, and they pretty much... You, you have to redo the entire thing, so uh, nice job. I feel really bad for you, though, like, seriously. But seriously, blame the construction workers, because they didn't put a wet cement sign. So, uh, nice one. Holy crudaloni! Someone's not getting into their Chrysler. <laughs> that is a lot of crows, I'm guessing, surrounding your Chrysler. That is absolutely terrible. Now you can't get in your car because the birds are probably going to peck at your head. And yeah, that's not going to be fun. Good luck trying to get in your car. And the thing is, that's a convertible, so one of the crows probably pooped in your seat. So, uh... This is why I don't like convertibles, because a bird could just poop on my seat. That's no food. Uh, uh, oh, oh, gosh, that's disgusting. That looks disgusting. What the heck is that? I don't know, and I don't even want to know. It looks like something. Oh, my gosh. So, apparently, this person was just riding his bicycle or motorcycle and got a chain stuck to its tire and got that on his chain that's uh that's unfortunate i really feel bad for you like seriously your luck must really be bizarre <laughs> how, how can you fix this though like seriously you have to like call like a bike company and be like uh so apparently a chain got stuck to my tire and the chain has some really disgusting stuff on it, so can you help with that? I said I hope you can get that stuff off your bike. Uh excuse me? Can I just ask you one question? Why? Why are you in your, the wet cement? There's cones literally everywhere. Like did you try to do a U-turn and just screw up completely? Like, what the heck even happened here? <laughs> Imagine you're just driving and you're just like, Oh, gotta take a U-turn, yee, and then you get stuck in wet cement. Like, that's no fun. Your car's pretty much stuck there forever, and the construction workers have to deal with that. So, uh, 
now everyone knows that you're the person who gets stuck in West Cement at a U-turn where those at a U-turn where those cones literally everywhere. Good job. Oh my goodness! That is so unlucky. I'm going to just leave because I'm overwhelmed by unlucky. Great. This is the last pressure we're gonna get through this. Okay, for the first part seems lucky though, but ooh, my dad's here. Hang on. First part seems okay, but the second part, how how are you gonna get the car out? Like seriously, that's that's not gonna happen. Your car is pretty much stuck there forever. Because if the boat moves just a little bit, then your car is just gonna fall into the water. That's not gonna be fun. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on notifications. Share this video with your friends. Tell them to subscribe. Road to 5K. Let's go. But anyway, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.